we're going to look at how to improve um, the speed when animating character animator. Um, if you've got a very complex character that's got lots of triggers, lots of layers and all that sort of stuff, or have a scene where you've got multiple characters within the scene, you'll find a lot of the time that you know, it'll take its toll on the processing and you'll start losing frames. So you're not getting a true representation of um, what your characters will be recording at. Um, a trick that we found to get around this is by lowering the resolution. I mean, at the moment we've got this at a very high res scene, so we can bring this all the way down. Let's just bring down something like this. And then we need to go to each character and just scale and reposition. So let's Now, if you notice, if we try and do any animations, we're not losing any frame rates. Uh, so, this way we can do our recordings. And so, what do we want to do with the character? Record, stop, playback, that all runs fine. And now, once we've gone through and done this for all our characters, all we need to do is go back to the scene, create the resolution that we require it to be, and rescale up the characters. So let's just do this on the robot. Put him up to 100%. Let's even make him bigger. Then when we play back, it's still going to retain the animations that we've got. So that's then ready for exporting or dynamic link to After Effects or Premiere. So basically, do all your animations at the low resolution, retain your frame rate, and then once you're happy with all that, bring everything back up, rescale, and export out. We find that's a good tip to improve workflow. Hope that helps.